Hey guys, Pictures Gaming here, and today I'm bringing you a video on Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. And uh, I'm going to show you guys my favorite Search and Destroy class because it's really the only game mode I play when I do play Cert, uh, when I do play COD. And here's my favorite class on the screen right now. And the primary I runs the Average Joe with. You can either use the HBRA3 or the BAL27. And because if you want to run the BAL27, you can use a parabolic microphone. You don't need a scope or sight for that one. And uh, for the, the average Joe, HBA, HBRA3 is a super, super solid gun, and it'll take people out in gunfights pretty easily. And I have a grip, a silencer, and target enhancer. You can use whatever sight you want. That's just preference. And the silencer and grip, silencer obviously, so you stay hidden on the map, and grip, probably the best attachment in this game. I don't run a secondary because I don't really feel like I need one in search because I don't really run out of ammo and the only reason you do is if you have pretty bad aim honestly or you're just shooting too much. And we have primary gunfighter to have all three um, attachments on the primary and we also have perk 2 greed. For perk 1 we have low profile so you can stay off the enemy UAV and uh, that's pretty useful because it keeps you off the map for like pretty cheesy stuff they could find you and easily kill you. Tier 2 perks. We have peripherals and cold blooded and you're probably wondering why I have peripherals. I have peripherals because it it shows it doesn't show when you kill them a skull will usually pop up so they can see where their teammate got killed and that won't pop up for them if you kill their teammate when you have peripherals on. And also if they shoot you can see basically the whole map if you're going side to side. And cold-blooded, you either run cold-blooded or gung-ho. I actually prefer gung-ho for this class. Um, but I was running cold-blooded because there's a lot of people using target enhancers. And you really get caught by call-outs and target enhancers. And cold-blooded takes both of those away. So that's a really useful perk. For perk 3, we have the blast suppressor, which obviously you guys should be running that in search. Unless you're not going to jump around a lot, but I do should try to avoid it because people will hear you either way but that doesn't really matter and for our, my score streak I run the UAV and I run support on it and I also run threat detection so support you can die and you keep getting credit towards it and then threat detection it shows them on the map like you have exo ping on so you can see them no matter where they are you can see them through walls and stuff when it when the UAV swipes over them and then for the launcher I use two Semtex, and that's just what I prefer. You can use any grenade, really, in this class, but my favorite is, is Semtex, obviously. You could also change it, use one Semtex, use one of the EXO abilities, but most of those aren't too good. And if you want to use a secondary or another score streak, you can put that in, but... Yeah, I hope you guys liked the video, because this is my favorite search class, and it's worked pretty well for me. Because I'm not the best COD player ever, but as you can see, I'm getting some nice kills in these clips. And, um... If you guys want to see more or want to see different types of videos, let me know in the comments below, and I'll see you guys next time.